Yo, lap, what's going on? It's the Latin Prince of the Airways, PGC TV special guest, K. Michelle. How Hello. How you, love? Good to see you again. Doing good. Just working, man. You always working, and I love it. I love it. Um, This is your moment, Rebellious Soul, in stores in a couple of days. Wow, that's unreal, huh? It is, it is. Man, I've, I've seen you just really grind to this moment. So I, I want to know, how does it feel personally, you know, when you got the album, it was finally mixed and mastered, it was in your hand. What was your feeling? Like, this is it. I still don't have it. You still don't? <laughs> I saw really? the cover last night. Yeah, but I still don't have it. That's crazy. So I'm going to get it in a little bit, but um, I haven't gotten it, so I can't answer that. Completely. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I mean, what do you what do you think it's going to feel like? I mean. I mean, I still don't. I don't think I have, it hadn't hit me. I have an album coming out. Like, I've just been doing promo for 10 years. <laughs> so, uh <laughs> It really hasn't hit me, so I'm just basically just, you know, just enjoying the ride and enjoy meeting my fans and, you know, just getting out there. Did you have, cre like, total creative control over this album? Yes, I did. Um, I had creative control over the album, and um, I worked with um, just a lot of different musical people. Like, Aaron Hudson did a lot on my album, this guy named Swag and uh, my MD Zoe, and um, Meeks on the album, and um, Jeezy's did the remix of my single VSOP and um, the album is just it's about 10 records on the album but there is a deluxe version that is uh, at Best Buy and it's three songs which are almost I love those songs so make sure you get the Best Buy version also there are interludes uh, secret interludes within the album that are basically almost songs so it's surprises in there within the album for everyone okay uh, any other special features that we could talk about no. no. <laughs> it's about me this time. It's all about K. Michelle. We love it. We love it. Um, well, you know, Rebellious Souls is about to come out. Mm -hmm. um, what else are you working on outside of uh, the music industry? Um, just a lot of different things. Uh, of course, I still have the reality TV thing. Um, I have my own show coming on VH1. So it's just about me as an artist. As a, I'm opening up my first business. I'm a mother. Uh, and my move to New York and, you know, I'm new to this love thing going on. So mm -hmm, mm -hmm. my life is, is, it's about that. So you guys check out the new show. It'll be coming out soon. Mm -hmm. Can you tell the people uh, the importance of the Judds? Oh, yes. Uh, the Judds was the first tape I ever got. Um, I love country music. I'm a big country music fan. You will never understand or get it. But they are really storytellers, and that's why my lyrics are so in detail that's why you can all paint the picture you have three minutes and 30 seconds to paint a whole story so every word counts in songwriting and i think a lot of songwriters take for granted of that so the judds and the dixie chicks and allison Krauss and a lot of different people taught me about being a songwriter as well as r kelly so it was it's a great thing okay well i know you're enjoying your moment what's one thing that you didn't expect like once you you got to this point, you know, you're still growing as an artist. Um, you know, what what do you think is like the one thing you just weren't ready for? Or, you know, just kind of like you taken back by? I think the lack of sleep. Um, <laughs> there's really, I really like to sleep. And there's <laughs> really no sleep. Um, I didn't know it was going to be that much, like not sleeping. And I think just the screaming. I didn't know they screamed that loud. Like when they see you, it's kind of scary sometimes. But you know it's all out of love. But I'm just not used to anybody screaming my name. Every time somebody screamed my name, it was my mama. And it was because I did bad. So, something. So, you know, I wasn't prepared for that. But I do appreciate it. Okay. Well, make sure you get Rebellious Soul comes out. August 13th. In 11 days, and um, I'll be all over the country, huh? Yeah, I'm going to say, your pre-sale is crazy. I see you retweeting every time somebody's yeah. like, I'm already pre-selling the album. Yeah, they've the been buying it, so. so I'm excited about it. So I'll be on the road a year with this album, really working the record. It's two full singles, um, other singles, other than VSOP coming out. And, yeah, we'll be in this record, this album, of a while. <laughs> okay. Well, I, I know you got to go. You got the show tonight at the Howard. Um, so... Uh, what do you think is just as far as the industry and, you know, them signing a lot of artists and just not the longevity of an artist anymore? And I feel like you definitely have that quality where you'll be around for a while. So, um, like you said, you'll be working this album mm -hmm. for a year. Um, just your thoughts on your longevity process. Basically, I think that process is very important. Like, we are worried about, everybody's worried about first week album sales. Mm -hmm. Well, R&B is a little bit different. It's a growing thing. You know, pop, yeah, rap. 
they want the numbers in the first place. I think labels aren't dedicated to making artists. One thing I like about Atlantic, they call me a career artist. Mm. And what that is, it's a marathon. And what they do with a career artist, they take it each step at a time and it's almost like the development and they let you do what you need to do within the development. So that's why R&B grows. And I still have a lot of non-believers. So we have Very to put cool. out the album to show them this body of work and how amazing it is. So, you know, as far as the artists and not having longevity, yeah, labels want really quick results. I've just been blessed to not be in that situation this time. Well, listen, not only can she sing, but she can perform as well. And you see it tonight at the Howard Theater. Yes. Kate Michelle, Aladdin, Prince of the Airways. Thank you so much and congratulations. Thank you for having me. All right. All right. We out. PGC TV. Hola.